to sound too trite or too accepting, but you and I both know it happens. You got to accept it and move on. Yardage, you got to get back. Focus on the next play and move on. It's a big play, yet amazingly, because of the field. And on the first drive, that can also help establish some rhythm. Oh, the Buccaneer pressure too much. Down he goes. We like to hit on every year are the new rule changes. So we got a few for 2023. A lot of procedural having to do with deadlines and roster construction and such. But the two league is doing it. They believe it promotes safety, and it's hard to argue against that. What about, I mean, this is the other one, guys can now wear the number zero. We've already seen some make the switch, Calvin. Ridley. Incomplete. Mayfield from the gun on third down. All right, rifles one, and that's going to be intercepted. Andrew Booth picks it off. And he will take this one home. It's a touchdown. So, Charles, our first points of the game provided defensively. What a play that was. And I can only imagine that the folks at home watching are thinking to themselves, that's one of those plays where once the ball leaves the quarterback's hands, you just sort of go, uh-oh, and wait for the result. Yeah, it's amazing how the narrative changes when you string them together. And he slips up past the 45 before being tackled. It's a gain of 11, and the Bucs that they might get hit with a screen. Maybe you can wind up slowing them down just a step. And if you do that, that's a win for that play. Mayfield's throw going to be into the hands of Evans here. Second, they do it for these situations. First down. And they build that trust, and that's why they're able to find him in this type of a situation. And he'll lose yardage here, going down back at the 28. I'm just hoping this is nothing serious. We'll take a quick timeout. And it bangs off the left upright and deflects away. It's no good. And this will stay at a seven-point game. So he had a chance to get a pick up the first down. From the shotgun, it's Mayfield. And he's going to have the hook up to Gage. And he is going to have a box first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Mayfield to throw it. Able to find the open man. That's complete. And brought down, but not before they're inside the 25. Out of the gun, it's a give to Vaughn. And he's brought down just outside of the 10 at the 11. That one a first. And now Mayfield on the bootleg. That's complete right around the 8. And the result here, a pickup of 8. Leaves him with 2. Again, this is White. And this time, he gets into the end zone. Touchdown, Tampa Bay. Well, he'd been the workhorse on this drive, and it would have been unfair to bring someone else in to finish the job. So they go back to the side has scored. Three punts isn't a bad thing. But when you're trying to set the pace and get up on top in a game, you got to show better offense and find a way to put some points on the board. To the team with a slight edge because they're trying to hold on to that, trying to increase it. Let's see how this one continues. And he'll be out of bounds, but able to get it up past the 44. It's a game as they're able to get the third down conversion. Mayfield's throw completes it. And they're going to have this across midfield. Here's Mayfield. And that nearly intercepted. Oh, the free safety roll. They need a full 10 here to pick up the first down and move the chains. Mayfield now on second down. Now he'll dump it underneath to his running back, complete. The Bucs going to go ahead and use the second of their timeouts. So that means they're down to one remaining here as we head toward him. And Evans hauls it in. Touchdown, Bucks. Four yards on the touchdown grab. And the Buccaneers will take the lead here in the final minute of the first half. There was no going through the progression. They go play action. Mayfield. Across the formation, he finds Godwin. And able to get this one across the 45. Because that receiver, all alone by right, that should have been a touchdown, but somehow this ball is overthrown. Now, meanwhile, they go for it on fourth down, and my goodness, incomplete. The Bucs try it on fourth down to come up empty. Cousins now to throw on first down. Into the hands of the rookie Jordan Addison. And he is tackled inside the 40, not quite to the 
Again, it's Fournette. And they take him down, losing yardage back at the 27. Shaquille Barrett there pushing upfield to make the stop. Throwing Cousins. And he's going to be taken down back around the 35-yard line. The big Vita Vea pushing his way through to line 22. It's a 52-yard attempt. Blankenship's kick is good. And they'll cut the lead back down to four now at 14-10. So as it turns out, that sack doesn't wind up. Vikings as they have it first and 10 at their own 37. And down he goes, a Buccaneer sack. Shaquille Barrett, no place for him to go. A nice job there, only giving up a three-yard gain. That's caught by Durham. And he is tackled inside the 40. Mayfield looks to throw. And look at this. They get the turnover they needed. It's intercepted. And the Vikings are right back in this football game. A critical error there in a tight game of the fourth. All you talk about is taking care of the football, and especially with a lead here in the fourth quarter. Turning it over. Now the door is open for the opposition. Just They'll start out on the ground. It's Leonard Fournette. And he'll take this across the 25 before going out of bounds. Four yards on the ground for him now. Struggled throughout this one. Here's Madison running on first down. Runs through the contact. And he'll be taken down, but not before he gets into enemy territory. It's a gain of 11 as the Vikings pick up. Cousins. A pass underneath for Fournette. Now a stoppage for the injury, and that's Leonard Fournette. He's going to get some medical attention, so hold everything here. Well, they're going to go for it here on fourth down. As expected, they're going for it to keep the drive alive. Pass taken in by his big tight end. And it'll be touched down here, but not before he... Cousins now. Middle of the field to Jefferson. And typically, what would you want to do against that dime? Run the football. You want to run the ball, but you can't do it. In this. And it's caught in the end zone. Touchdown, Minnesota. K.J. Osborne from six yards away. And the Vikings put together a fourth-quarter drive to take the lead. see him scrambling down there they're getting those defensive guys ready yes you have to get those guys ready and you also have to talk to your special teams guys make sure the kickoff is exactly what you want now on the return oh no the ball is loose but it looks like one of the dbs has it and his guys are going to get the football at the 23 yard line now mayfield and oh that one nearly intercepted that would have sealed it Mayfield. And he can't get a throw off. He's taken down. What a huge play at this point in the game. Desperation time. Mayfield on fourth down. That's going to be knocked away and incomplete. The CD always a little extra excitement for week one. And one of our early window games here in week one on a Sunday comes to a close. Good to be back in the booth with you, my friend. And it's good to be back in the booth with you as well. And we know that not everyone's going to start the season 1-0, right? Half the league is going to have a loss on their record. But everyone's got to build off of that opener. And how many coaches tell us...